Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel or welcome to my YouTube channel. I am Devin and today we're going to be taking a look at Geometry Dash's update 2.2. It's it's their second sneak peek that they've done and I think I'm going to give a little bit of when I think that update 2.2 might actually come out. It's took in a while but eh. it seems like it's going to be good. I've watched this thing already five times. So, but now I'm going to show you it because it's only a minute long. Okay, so, oh, and creepy little stair, of course, it's gotta be a creepy little stair. Anyway, so, I'm just gonna quickly bring this back here and kinda point out little spots, so it's gonna be playing again. Okay, well, first off, I do like the way that they did this design, I'm really hoping that Rob Top actually releases this as one of their levels. I'd assume so if they're doing this as a sneak peek. But at the same time, the last one they showed also wasn't. So hopefully this is one of the levels. I really hope. I it looks it looks fun to do. <laughs> Uh, but it does look like they added a new spike unless I've just missed that spike. I'm not sure, but also seems like they've added more design and everything. Like, we can see these little torches type of things and everything and whatnot and such. And I do like the shading and everything with the background. Like, little chain right here, too. Where they're already technically being used right here. But using this as background and everything, you know, just kind of makes it look better. I do also notice the fact that there's a new icon. Yet again, unless I somehow missed it. But I really doubt I missed a new icon. I also did notice these things. They seem very interesting. I, I don't make many Geometry Dash levels, but I can tell how th those are going to be very useful. <laughs> and going to be something very interesting as well. I feel like it's basically Spider, but only for a specific, like, orb, you know? Because it brings you up just about as fast as a as spider. Just can go side to side as well. Depending on which way the arrow's faced. Okay. So it looks like they added a new version of the that portal. I'm pretty sure it's like... Clone portal or... No, that's not it. Uh, it's... It's that teleporting portal where you go through one of them and you come out the other and everything. But notice the fact that clicked on this one, went over here. Just, I think this time it's an orb instead. So that that is going to be interesting. I don't really feel like that's going to be as much of a help as the rest of these. But at the same time, I'm not going to complain. Unless it's a hard thing to do in a level, of course. <laughs> but, but at the same time, I could probably complain about every single Geometry Dash level. So. <laughs> now I'm also curious, though. Where, what, what is these blue ones? Because they're basically a triangle. So... And they're not really pushing you, they're just changing your gravity. Like, that reminds me of the blue orb, but the blue orb still at least makes you jump a little bit. Or is that the... 
Sorry, I haven't played Geometry Dash in a week, and I see this, so it's sorry if I'm getting orbs confused. It also seems that back there a moment ago, they also use, used the, the teleporting portals there and just gave a little bit of a glow, it seems, as well. So that seems neat. Okay, so I don't think it's anything we haven't necessarily seen yet, but we can go up now. I'd assume we can also go down and everything, and I, it seems that they also added more decoration stuff as well here. Oh, that just seems like it's gonna be so hard to do. <laughs> just looking at it. Of course, it's probably not as hard as it looks, so. I'm curious where they're going to put this. Because I don't think I've ever seen that in Geometry Dash, Geometry Dash Light, Geometry Dash World, or any of the other two Geometry Dashes, the Meltdown and Sub-Zero. I don't think that's in any of them. Like, at all. So, I'm very curious. Where, like, where they're gonna put it. Like, maybe it'll just be, like, another type of chest room and everything, but... I'm curious what might be inside of it, and obviously you need some sort of keys, so... See? There's four doors in here, so I think what's gonna happen is you're probably gonna need a key to get in first, and then you need four more keys, maybe? Maybe it's like a pick-your-own-door, or maybe it's different levels, hencing by the... the skull right above this one it would probably be the most dangerous given the fact that it's also on a ledge and you can't even get up to it so <laughs> yeah. oh and then of course the creepy stare <laughs> so but given the fact that this is rob top's second sneak peek and everything here let's go to rob top and whatnot Geometry Dash 2.2 Update Sneak Peek. Particle Editor. There's so much things that's been going for three years. Okay. Like, it's so many that the homepage goes down to five. Like, 34 minutes ago, two weeks ago, one year ago. Like, that's a big difference. So, let, let me see if I can go back to... Oh, there's 2.0. Oh, but, see, given the fact that 2.1, it had a single sneak peek. It seems. Just one. So, if I had to guess, that means Geometry Dash is, like, almost there. Like, almost ready to post it. They just haven't yet. They just said, you know what, not yet. Because either they're doing the finishing touches or whatnot. <laughs> I, I have no clue. So, but you know what, while we are here, we might as well watch the other sneak peek. Just because I can give my input on that one as well. However, I should restart it. Oof. Bye. 
Okay. So, honestly, the majority of that first bit, I really don't have any opinion on. It's mainly this area. Let, let's go back to the beginning of seeing it. Or, more like right here. Well, first off, with the area that they died, it, in the fact that Scratch ended up saying, watch your step, and it's in green, I feel like that means something, but I don't know what. Like, I want to know what it means. It, it's got to mean something, you know? But let's, let's just let it go for another one. Okay, so obviously we can see right over here it's like parts of a coin and whatnot if you're trying to get a coin. I did, I'm not sure if you'd necessarily need to collect them. I'm not sure. I'd assume you do to be able to pass the area. Let's see. I also noticed the moving platforms. I, I, I'm pretty sure everyone can probably know w what those are by this point, that they're coming to Geometry Dash. I'm pretty sure we all know that. <laughs> Those are what caught my attention right here. The things that will want, like, once you're there, because those kind of reminded me of. I can't remember what game it was. It's one of the Mario games and everything, where once you're close enough to the wall, it'll just go down and everything, and once it goes back up, then you have to go for it before it realizes you're there again. Or whatever it is, I'm not even quite certain what it's called. I haven't played Mario stuff for a while. Uh, <laughs> but those are interesting, because they're, they're going three in a row right next to each other. Can you, like, maybe squeeze right in between? Is it whenever someone gets near, or is it just a timer? That's now my question with it. Oh, four in a row, sorry. Oh, let's bring it back a tiny bit. And then, of course, right here with, what, do you have to jump and everything? How do you get on that one? You jump and everything, that'll bring you here. How do you get up here? What, are you able to stick to the wall or something? Because that would be the only thing that makes sense. You know? This is confusing how how, how that's going to work, but... that that Because I can see, like... Maybe they just forgot to put one of the pads down here so that way you can. I'm not sure, but... <laughs> they, they need something... <laughs> Like, I, I don't think a Geometry Dash uh, uh, character can do that. I doubt it. But anyway, I do hope you guys found this helpful to see this. Because, well, some people may not have seen it yet. Now, if I had to guess, given the fact that there's been two sneak peeks, this sneak peek was a year ago. But, we have a sneak peek that just happened. We also have lit. I'm pretty sure even, like, here, let me go over to it right now. Pretty sure even Geometry Dash Light is on, uh, 2.2 right now. And everything, with, like, the whole- oh, oops. With, like, this whole spot and everything, like, I'm pretty sure it's already on 2.2. We also have- Sub-Zero, and we also have Meltdown, and I'm pretty sure almost everything except for the main game has been updated by this point. So, if I had to guess when this is coming out, given the fact that now they've done two sneak peeks and has almost everything updated, that we're probably getting it within a month or two, honestly. <laughs> I think what they're doing right now is they're just making sure they have the levels all finique properly, they're doing all the extra details. That's probably what they're doing, honestly. That or they're just procrastinating it more. But they probably don't want to continue procrastinating it. So, but anyway, I do hope you guys did find this helpful or enjoy it or hopefully both. Um, 
if you guys have any ideas or comments or concerns, do please mention in one of my videos. I think what I'm going to do is, like, I'm going to make a probably, like, five-second video for each different series that I have and everything. So that way I can get comments from people without having to worry. And I just link those in, like, the description, you know? Because that would be so helpful. Plus, then I only have to look at so many video comments, so... At the same time, I'd prefer the comments on each video just be shared, but unless I make... I'm pretty sure it's, like, ten minutes or less, my comments keep getting shut off, so... Yeah. But anyways, that's the end of the video, so... Bye.